Hello everyone, welcome to Cooking with Logan. My name's Logan and today we're going to be making fruit salad. Uh huh? A fruit salad, really? Do we have to? Huh, look, I'll have you know, bananas are a high source of potassium, contain natural sugars, uh, oranges are full of antioxidant vitamin C, um, these are tasty treats on a hot day. But Logan, it's so hot outside. They want something refreshing. Oh yeah? Then what do you have in mind? Uh, okay, uh, hear me out on this one. Huh? Huh? Okay. Huh? And... Ah. And... Popsicles, silly! Popsicles! Popsicles? Popsicles! Popsicles? Popsicles! Popsicles? Yes! And you've... You've got everything... Yes! Okay, I... I guess we gotta make popsicles? Yes! Yes! Yes guys, today we are actually making Dixie Cup popsicles. Um, they're gonna be a whole lot of fun. They're gonna be super easy. And I guess they're gonna be more exciting than a uh, fruit salad. So uh, before we kick off this video, gotta say thanks to ExploreNet for sponsoring this month's boxes. Without ExploreNet, we wouldn't be able to get all the activity boxes out to you kids and we wouldn't be able to make these videos. So thank you, ExploreNet. All right, guys, for Dixie Cup popsicles, you're gonna need two cups of boiling water, two cups of cold water, you're gonna need three quarter cup of sugar. I've got a Kool-Aid packet and a jelly powder here. Uh, you're also gonna want, uh, obviously, some popsicle sticks, uh, a bowl to mix everything in, and some Dixie cups to pour your popsicles into. First, we're gonna start off by mixing all of our ingredients into one bowl. So we're gonna mix in our sugar. Obviously, that's gonna make it sweet. Uh, we're gonna mix in our Kool-Aid. Um, this is just gonna give it flavor, really. And we're also gonna mix in our gelatin powder. Uh, now you've had Jello before. Uh, this is gonna make it so that it gets nice and thick and stable, uh, and it's also gonna add some more flavor. Once you're done mixing those together, we gotta boil our water. Now I boiled my water in a, a kettle, um, and the reason you need boiling water is because sugar won't mix with cold water. You need hot water. And, also, um, the chemicals in jelly, uh, they aren't activated unless you add really hot water. Uh, things won't solidify unless you start with that very hot water. Uh, and please be uh, careful with this. This is a uh, hundred degrees Celsius and uh, it's only 30 degrees Celsius outside right now. So we're gonna pour in our boiling water. Uh, this is two cups of boiling water. And we're gonna mix that around until everything is dissolved, one solid liquid. Okay, it seems all our sugar and jello granules are dissolved. Now we're gonna pour in two cups of cold water. Uh, this is just gonna help it freeze when we put it in the freezer. Now you might wanna get an adult to help you transfer it into a sort of something that can pour a lot better, um, because guess what? It's popsicle time. Oh, really? It's... Yes, a popsicle time. So, to initiate popsicle time, uh, I actually put my Dixie cups in a little container. Uh, that way it'll be easier to pull them out of the freezer. Um, and now all you gotta do is uh, take your popsicle mixture and pour it one by one into the Dixie cups, uh, filling them most of the way up. And with only a little bit of spill, uh, we're good to throw these bad boys into the freezer. So I'm gonna whip these into the freezer. Close her up. And you might be thinking, 
What about the popsicle sticks? Well, we're gonna wait until they're partially frozen. Then we're gonna stick the popsicle sticks in. Uh, that way they're in the center and not like leaning off to the side. So uh, just give your uh, popsicles a little bit of time and then we'll pierce them. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> hey guys, it's been an hour and a half and our popsicles are about half frozen. As you can see, we've got one stuck already and we're gonna stick the rest. And uh, do your best to stick them upright, but they're gonna taste the same either way. I'm gonna put these back in the freezer for a couple more hours and then we're ready to eat. After two hours, it's, it's, it's popsicle time. So what I recommend you guys do, um, these probably won't pull out super easy, so you can go ahead and take some scissors, kind of shove them in there and cut the Dixie cup. And then you can kind of just start to peel your popsicle. And voila, perfectly intact and delicious. So this means I get a popsicle, right? Oh, popsicles for you? No, 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 you're, you're still getting fruit salad. No, <laughs> no, no. Silly Billy. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed our uh, Dixie Cup Popsicle video. Please let us know how yours turn out. Uh, comment, message us a picture or video, whatever. We would love to see it. Um, otherwise, uh, we hope you guys are excited for the rest of the events we have going on this month. We have an Among Us game night this Wednesday. Uh, get rid of the imposter or weed out your crewmates in this very, very fun online game. So make sure you sign up for that. Uh, otherwise, at the end of the month, we've got a Kahoot trivia night where you can compete against other kids in a really fun game of interactive trivia. For both of those game nights, all participants will be entered into a draw to win a prize, so make sure you sign up for those. Um, if you want to, just message us on Facebook, text us, or send us an email. Until then, guys, it's been a lot of fun, and hope you enjoy your popsicles. Take care. Bye-bye.